can you give us an example of a leader with a well-established leadership brand? Well, you know, it's, uh, you, you can think of people like Richard Branson, who's the CEO of uh, Virgin. And uh, one of the things that I've done uh, on several occasions is compared his leadership brand to someone like Jeff Immelt or Jack Welch. And so you see Richard Branson is very playful uh, when he's uh, in, in public, and I'm sure that's the way he is in, in person. So he's playful, he's very innovative, he's very casual in terms of his demeanor, doesn't wear a suit, uh, he's not ever wearing a tie, uh, he lives on a Caribbean island, so he's got this, uh, or, or not a Caribbean island, but an, an island somewhere that we all want to be. Uh, whereas, and, and that connects to the, the firm brand or the image of that we have about Virgin. They're, they're innovative, they're, they're kind of a playful company, they're, they're on the cutting edge, they're ca more casual. Uh, whereas if you think about a GE, so you think about uh, a, a Jeff M. Alter, a Jack Welch, just a lot more around uh, uh, the, their style tends to be a little bit more serious, more gravitas, uh, uh, always wearing a suit, uh, uh, talking about accountability and execution and keeping our promises and their strategy and so just a much different style that also uh, reflects the, the, the kind of company that uh, General Electric is. So very different styles, both very different brands and identities and both kind of fit the, the firms that, uh, that they represent.